can't believe I fucking forgot. I was supposed to be doing a video this whole time. It's just a quick topic for those of you who live in London. And even you guys outside of London, you would have seen. It's kind of really the whole fucking country at this point. Motorcycle thefts are going crazy in this country. People in, especially in London, people are getting their bikes stolen in broad daylight. Members of the public are filming everybody's bikes getting nicked. And no one's doing anything. Doesn't seem like anyone gives a fuck. The police don't seem to be doing anything because the people nicking them are just riding around central London on like no plates, don't, not giving a fuck, riding up the pavement, running red lights. They're stealing people's fucking phones and shit out of their hands, let alone people's like Panigales they've saved god knows how many fucking years probably to own. And no one's doing anything. It's just a piss take. So, someone, forgive me, I don't know their name, on Facebook has set up a group called the uh, like motorcycle theft protest or something, London motorcycle theft protest. And basically what they are doing is campaigning against this shit happening and trying to get the government, anybody really, insurers, MPs, whatever, to take notice and actually put something in place that will, I don't know, maybe give the police a kick up the arse or give the police the power to actually do something because right now, as you may know, the police won't chase motorcyclists through London. Number one, they're not going to fucking keep up. And number two, because they have a duty to the public where they can't, you know, knowingly cause harm to people. And that includes little thieving bastards who want to steal your bike. They can't cause harm to them by running them off their bikes. Which, you know, I wouldn't be... It's not Roger. <laughs> I wouldn't be... Uh, opposed to it. I couldn't give a shit, you know? I say... You know, I say fuck it, run them off their bikes. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness, you want to go faster? Uh, yeah. Fuck it. But anyway, back to the point. Motorcycle theft protest. There's a ride out this Sunday from Ace Cafe to the Houses of Parliament, 10 Downing Street, all that shit. Just to fucking try and raise awareness I, and just see if anything can be done because, you know, it's, it's coming to the point where people are getting pissed off and, you know, no one wants their bike getting nicked. They know, they know there's going to be consequences if they take action, but someone sooner rather than later, I think, is going to, you know, put a fucking two-foot torque wrench around one of these guys' heads and probably kill him. And then the police are going to have to take notice once people start dishing out vigilante justice and shit. And we don't want that bollocks, do we? Where we're just beating people to death. But it would be a deterrent for these little bastards. But so again, if you want to go and show your presence, show your support for this kind of stop these little shitheads being able to freely go around nicking everybody's bikes. I'll put all the links in the description for the group. It's on Facebook. Ride out this Sunday, Ace Cafe, half ten. There's a route and all that shit. They've got little flyers, you can read the flyer. And it's basically no bullshit. We're not going... It, the, the aim of this is not to fucking cause chaos and go 
doing fucking wheelies and burnouts and fucking flying through London. You know, people sometimes forget that motorcyclists are people as well. You'll notice how people kind of treat you weirdly in their cars, like they'll do, they'll drive weirdly weird actions if like threatening to hit you and stuff. There's some fucking glasses there. Because I'm sure they just forget that you're a human being under the helmet and under the leathers. And people need to realise that again. It's not just... It's not just money being stolen from people. You take someone's livelihood away. If you take my bike away from me, you're literally taking my day-to-day -day life away. And it is really hard to deal with that shit. Look, if you still matey boys fucking jicks are here with the scaffolding pipes and the no no gloves, you're taking his livelihood. He's got new tires. S21s, brother! <laughs> Where are your gloves? Where are your gloves? That thing sounds horrible. He nearly fucking just crashed it. Did you see that? He nearly bit it. That was embarrassing. I don't trust him. I don't trust that guy. I hope that wasn't a fucking me proving my point. I hope that was his bike. <laughs> 